and Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman for the 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network Market Update. And we're looking at the Dow uh, down 175 to 31,160. Really struggling. Even Friday, the look was a doji close. Just struggling. And uh, we'll see how the 31,000 uh, level holds the support. It really must hold the support. And in fact, by Tuesday or Wednesday, there has to be, just in terms of pattern uh, formation, there needs to be a close above Friday's half, 31,511. That, that's really important, just to get that upside momentum again. And it's kind of stalling, waiting for, I guess, earnings this week. You've got the S&P also down. The S&P at this particular point is down uh, 48. No, 45. At 38.54, same thing, taking too much time on the right side of the cup formation. This is not so good. It needs to get to the 38.78 or higher area by uh, certainly by uh, tomorrow and by Wednesday, maybe making a new recovery high. Looking at the QQQ, was holding much better. Now it's down 5.67 at 289.71. Needs to get back into 292, 295 area quite soon. Otherwise, this is just stuck, going nowhere. Looking at the IWM, same thing, stuck, going nowhere, down three and a quarter at 172. What is important is that gold um, is... Holding our case down three at 1739, even as the dollar is breaking out to new recovery highs, this is multi year highs, at 108.03 up a dollar 11. This is a really fantastic action. It's done more than a one to one now to the upside, Chapman Wave parallel one to one. And you're looking at the euro. I didn't do that earlier on. I usually do, but I forgot. Euro is taking out the left side low and certain left side low of Friday. Not very good action at all. Looking at the TLT, that's bonds. Bonds, very nice move up, 214 at 114.64. If you look at the U.S., uh, that's the bonds, the actual contract itself, made a peak D at 100, around about 142, pulls back sharp to the 136s, and now it's moving. It's attempting to go at least sideways to hold support so that yields don't really either break down or break out to the upside at this particular point. And crude oil, crude oil is trading down Two and a half at 102.19, stuck in the low range. Don't forget, folks, here at TFNN, we start the day off at nine with uh, Tommy Jr., a market kickoff. Go all the way to Tom Sr. at uh, three o'clock to four. We've got after me, we've got Larry Fazavento, then Think or Swim, then Steve Rose, Dave White, and Tom O'Brien. Have a wonderful day. Check it out. Also, check out Hope will make it See you tomorrow. Have a wonderful day.